All right, folks, I'd like to apologize to everybody who's watching this channel for Hollow Knight for the fact that I haven't played this in a couple of months. Uh, just blame a myriad of things causing that. I took a, a multiple month stream hiatus even, so uh, yeah, that happened. Let's go ahead and let's go in here to Dirtmouth, Dirtmouth. The dirt zone. Joe Dirt's Empire of Dirt. I... <laughs> this is just getting sillier and sillier. And let me uh, take a moment here to refamiliarize myself with the controls. Who the fuck references Joe Dirt in 2020? Yeah, I know, right? I'll tell you who, it's people who just remember these phrases out of nowhere. Alright, Bogo, uh, let's travel. Um, gotten crossroads? I think that's pretty close to where... Oh, that's rumbling pretty heavily in my eardrums. I don't know how it sounds for the rest of you fine folks, but... It is, uh, it does have some volume. Set am I. Oh, uh, this guy's just here to insult us. Thinking of a different show. There's a lot of shows in this world. So, what I was trying to say, if I can remember to say it, was that I believe that this is not far from the place where we wanted the lantern for. Is that... Oh, no, that's... That's my... My big shot. It's L to view the map. I think we want to go further up. Ow. <laughs> Anybody doing the, the Joe Mama thing makes me think of very specifically the version of it that I saw that was like Oedipus, you'll you know, and, and marry Joe, and then it just goes, who's Joe? And, yeah. Do I, do I need to, like, pull this lantern out or something? Uh, select? Oh, that's, that's the heal button. Uh, what do you got here? Pull machine with the symbol of a gate. We've got 51, let's do this. Okay, it's passive. All right. Again, keep in mind, I haven't touched this for a couple of months. We're we're getting the raw experience here. Ow. This would be good practice for me bouncing on things. But I know it's like, well, I should probably... Uh... Bold move to be healing in the middle of the line of fire, and that is a... That's why it's a, uh, a bit of a mistake here. I like them, like, having particles bounce off of them. How... How chunky are these fellas? Well, after all, I'm not doing a ton of damage to them. Ow. Well... The only way you'll get better is by not fucking up. After all. Okay, yeah, that. Do do something? Uh, right stick. Round. Okay, I just had to make sure, because. You get it. Talk to Elderbug for guidance. Okay, duly noted, and I'm in the incorrect place if I want to, uh, fast travel. Oh. Well, thank you for just knocking- letting me drop down the hole there. Uh. Jump over. For some reason, even though I just walked down that, my brain is like, oh, it's gotta have, like, a- a, a thing that you press down on. Alright, what do you got for me, my friend? Remember almost nothing. Well, that doesn't sound like a great thing. Okay. 
So yeah, shopkeeper, fast travel station. What do you have? Five hundred for the mask shard. Five fifty for the vessel fragment. Nine fifty for the simple key. And then we've got a couple of these. I feel like I'm going to need to grab that egg at some point. Yeah, let's have a look at our... Uh, oh, we can't look at that now, in here. Dang it. What do you got to say for me? Oh, you're a cranky uh, fella here. Gotcha. That's right. That's for. It's basically map tools. You double check that there's nothing else going on here. Well, there's the locked door, which we need the simple key to get into, obviously. Let's double check that the old fella here doesn't have anything extra to say. Stag station. Excuse me, I might have a lot to cycle through because I haven't talked to him before. Stag station. This is that temple building. Ah, right, yep. Oh, My dog's barking again. Nakala, him tono. Tell me about the bench. All right. So, I believe that we want to go back over to the left. A bit of a. Oh, I'll call him back. All right, buddy. Yeah, so we don't have a. Uh, we don't have a station to the left yet, because I failed to pick one of those up last time. Okay, yeah. That, that's what I thought, is that I gotta go to... I gotta go back to Green Path, which... That is correct. I do need to go and handle that. So I probably could have... Done that? Uh, how far is the... Uh... It would help if I pressed L1 and not L2. So I will go ahead and I'll actually just take the I'll take the stag anyway because it was like literally two rooms over from there. And it might technically be faster than walking. Next one up. Oh, you're gonna do this? I thought that one came at me, so. Oh, game category is unfixed. I will fix that really quickly. Give me just a moment. I forget to do that a lot, so. 
Yeah. Yeah. Uh, stream manager. Mute that real quick. Edit. Uh, mute that real quick. Gosh dang it. Go in here. Hollow Knights. Play through that, and yes, thank you for thank you for reminding me to fix that because that is a thing I need to I need to do better. Right, continue. I I healed already. Pincher fella. This room again. Thank you. Uh, I I just kind of goofed that up. That was me failing to time properly. All right, so we're gonna go back in here, and we're going to head back to Dirtmouth. Dirtmouth home. Which is good because that will place that will place the stag right over there, and. Well, I'll probably have to I'll probably have to call for it later anyway cuz surely surely I'm going to find another another station somewhere and I'm also surely going to go wow, I don't have enough geo for that. Left Gotcha. Or I can just fall in the acid like a fool. Heal up all the way just to make sure. Here. Okay, so here we are back in green path. Okay, so far left is looking like our, uh... wow, I didn't see that for a second, whoops. And again, I've forgotten how a lot of these enemies fight. there. Yeah, so I think we want to go over to the left there, the, the furthest left bench marker. I hit that way too late, sorry. And that, I think, is where we'll encounter a station, possibly. It would be a good idea to get as many of those as possible unlocked. Because, given the kind of game this is, the, 
just the overall genre, I'm expecting backtracking is going to be a lot heavier than I've really given it credit for. And yes, I am checking my map quite a lot, it's true. A lot of that is just like, I don't know where I'm going. I mean, I kind of do, but only a little. Only in the vaguest degree. I know I'm going to the left. About it. Oh, I did notice. Oh, yeah, there's like a little rippling effect on the bottom of some of those floors. I guess that's for. Oh, you bastard. What a jerk. I'm over here trying to say something. That fella's out there making me look like an idiot in terms of timing. I'm guessing just because of like pattern recognition and everything that the floors with the little wavy bottom bits that's where the acid is or I mean it it's boiling and it's green it's got to be acid right or something very similar what is in here is something in here or are we just getting a couple of a couple of these fellas Uh, you're quite a stout gen quite the stout gentleman, I see. I do not have that rhythm down yet. That's gonna take some doing. One problem is with like games that are very action oriented that I tend to get very bad at them is that I often practice doing things wrong just by by sheer force of like not intentionally it's not like oh I'm trying really hard to be bad at this video game everybody I just kind of goof up and then keep goofing up and then I get so used to doing it incorrectly in in like a way where it's like you have to try basically uh, map. Oh, you did that, do you? Mostly have your shots blocked by walls because of positioning. Yikes! Ow. doing this more that the fact that you jump as high as you do feels really strange to say the least all right good thing pick the map left okay Okay, so I don't have enough to do this right now. I may as well, like, go ahead and grind for that 140. I was gonna get hit by that some way or another. Alright, recharge. Oh, they're they're up there. Okay. Yeah, let's see if I remember how to deal with them as I did before. Is this is this that room? Uh, map. Not the most helpful. I think it's the. I think it's the area up from here. Wait a second. Yeah. 
Did I go too high? I think I did. I also see an area that is... I didn't remember the, uh... Back up for a second. Yeah, we get it. We, we get what you're... Did I not get that catapult? Did I not get that caterpillar before? Oh, there's another, another one of our mossy night buddies here. Oh wow, there are two of them in here. What? <laughs> that's that's not an ideal situation to be in. That's for sure. Back it up. Back it up. Back it up. Back it up. I need to go open the stag station, so that's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Alright, so now we have... We have our access over here. Rest. No need to hit the bell right now. Uh, map. And Fog Canyon is where I'm going next, right? <laughs> that sounds like the right place. And it is, it is off of here. Oh yeah, I've got the, uh, plants are off and hiding in the brush which when I say it like that it sounds incredibly silly as if everything I say doesn't sound incredibly silly to begin with It's just one of these, okay. I seem to remember those being a lot easier. Fog Canyon. Won't be able to explore much of it until much later, but it gets you to where I need to go. Okay. Well, that's fine by me as long as I get to where I need to go. forward momentum I wanted. Again, I thought I had that forward momentum in the fall, but not enough. Don't try to do things like that. It's okay, there's a bench nearby, I believe. I think that's a lower level. Nope. 
that to myself. Okay. And yes, that's that's down into the right. Okay. Bench real quick, get our save, and go to the, uh, for the rest of the room. Oh wow, that, that fellow was on the ceiling too! So, um, that's definitely somebody's ass. As I see, we've got those things from Yoshi's Island, basically, uh, attacking us. The, the, the shooting plants that are always completely miserable. Drop into Fog Canyon. We'll here have to be known as... Particle Effects Canyon? I can hit the projectiles back. Okay, I... I don't think I knew that, so that's legitimately very helpful. And there's me trying to do it on that thing. Uh, think down, buddy. That. Okay, uh... Not those. Well, I mean, there's not much to knock them at, but... Ow! Is that one health? Do those do multiple damage? <laughs> if those do multiple damage, that's kind of... That's kind of nasty. Okay, they do do multiple damage. Gotcha. Ouchies. That's, uh... That's kind of a lot. So basically, the general advice is do not fuck with those things at all. Which admittedly, I think I can respect that at this point. Get back down here. Our shade is going to be a little... Oh, it's in the next room over, right. In particular, for some reason, I can't really necessarily describe a lot of areas in this game so far are giving me very strong vibes, very specifically of Metroid 2. Which, you know, I know that there's going to be like a little bit of, oh, it feels like a Metroid game in a, you know, something of this style, of course. But specifically that one, and I think a lot of it is just because of the, the extremely organic uh, places like this, basically. And not, not the remake. I've never played Samus Returns. I've heard... I've heard decent things about Samus Returns. Look at... Yeah, now we're listening oh, to this. Run... Out of bank. I don't have enough for that. Okay. Gotcha. It seems like something that would be useful for me because I die a lot. The, the little fellas don't drop any Geo. Do the, the big ones? I now realize that I didn't pay a ton of attention to that. Yes. Yes, they do. They also drop a big fucking fireball, which I have to be really careful of. Can I not go back up? No, there's steps on the other side. I just couldn't see them from over there. Ow! Whoops! <laughs> I'm 
sometimes I gotta remember that in video games, your characters get ridiculous amounts of knockback. Ow! I tried to jump that, honest! I just did it very slow. It's okay, I've got a nice little meter there, I can... Find something safer to farm the money off of, though. Over this way is another. Oh. What do you got, Chief? If I keep going the way I was, there's a bench nearby. Let me, uh... I can't shoot through that, can I? No. It's been a while, I haven't had that come up for a bit. So it was, I suppose, worth a shot. See what's going on around here. Else to say about it? <laughs> Maybe one more, just to be sure. I'm like, wait a second, is there something special, even more special about this? Apparently not. Am I gonna want to do this? Again? <laughs> going to want to, uh. Very clearly, do not have a map of Fog Canyon, so I can't pin that down for sure. Uh, it looks like the buddy from before, yeah, the fellow from before, is gone. That door is locked. There's a door at the bottom. Did I check the top right of this room? I feel like I did not. And I do want to check out what's going on around here, just in general, below where Willow was. Uh, all right, so fungal waste. This is where I need to go. I'm gonna go check that lower left room. There's a bench. And also a stag station that, again, not enough money for. It's only 120, though, so it's all right. Uh, what's out in the bottom right? Is this a door or is it just a... Ooh, I think that's an escape path from up above, maybe. That gate closed behind us when we go in and get the shard. I feel like that's the kind of thing that would happen. That sounds like level design to me. Or maybe it just sounds like the sort of thing that I would do, of just like, okay, here's... You get a little extra puzzle for your... For your something or other here. Let me readjust in this chair real quick. Meanwhile, y'all can get more of that rusty sound. I'm sure everybody is loving that. Oh. Oh, come on. I I definitely pressed the button there, but I might have been a little late. All right, Sneezy. Uh, I'll just ignore you. That thing got a little high up, so... Uh, and that piece of paper is unfortunately nothing. Yeah. Well, I mean, I, I now that I see multiple of them, I'm going to assume that that's a... Uh, it's trying to lead me somewhere. Oh, I hear you down there. Oh. Alright, buddy. Good to see you. Cornifer, whose name I forgot. Alright. About finished sharding these caves. Oh, 
Oh, we're six shorts. Oh, okay, so you gotta... Gotcha, so... That's the DuckTales way. Oh, I had a feeling that... I had a feeling that fellow was gonna explode. Corner for here's 75. What do we got going on here? So I know that the, like, bounce on things to gain height mechanic was a thing in, uh, in Rogue Legacy. I, I'm trying to remember if that was something that was specifically utilized in DuckTales or if it was just the fact that you bounce on, on stuff at all. That, that was, like, a very important method of attack in DuckTales. I haven't played DuckTales in a very, very long time. Which I'm sure has been made quite clear by my being like, how does it do it? I can do it off spikes. That's, uh... That's sure something. Looks like I can't go that way. That door is a little bit uh, logger jammed there. I'm pretty sure I just have to go back up. Wrong button. That was silly. Let's just say that our buddy had to sneeze really, really bad. That's one big sneeze. Explode nor seem to snort at us. Not like this thing that just lets out a huge stream of that stuff. I know, right? What what a terrible time to not be wearing a mask. That's a decent uh, output there. Oh, okay. Hmm. That's gonna be. Of orange signifying danger. That makes that makes some sense. Oh, um.
That's a nice grab. Whoa. Although I gotta say that all of the, uh, the, the spitting mushroom patches with the, like, basically remote mine kind of attack, that's a little scary. That's a little scary. Again, yeah, they they remind me of the the wall clinging things in Yoshi's Island that spit the the yellow spike balls at you, and like you can only deal with by ground pounding, and they just temporarily get stunned. Those things were often in some really neat places, if I remember Yoshi's Island correctly, which I can't necessarily say that I do for sure, because it has been many a year since I've played it, but. I think I remember that, at least. <laughs> oh, this is a great enemy. Same to you. Yikes. Right up until they die, they kind of... <laughs> I was going to say, they kind of sound like the penguin, but less... Less... You know, not, not as much like Dick Cheney. Not a great place to be fighting that fella. Alright. Out of here. Refill. I could probably be hitting R1 more against some of these fellas, right? Oh yeah, that was pretty effective. Okay, so we got the big lever here. That's a permanent thing, I hope. Have I been in here before? I have not. Oh, wait. I think I have, actually, and it just hasn't updated yet. Heck! Should've looked down before I fell all the way down the room. Here for a moment. Definitely some kind of. Maybe not. That's an oddly placed background element, then. So we're at 104 out of the 120 that we want to buy a stag station. And I failed to jump. All right. 
So that's definitely a gate. This is going to be sort of a... Uh, Sort of a little mini boss here, right? I think I'm ready for this. Oh, we got two. This is, uh, Playing with fire a little bit there. Ooh, big payout. Uh, does this does this one get angrier? Are you gonna start seeing new attacks, or is this gonna be pretty easy? All right. Pick this up. Charm notch. All right. Uh. Yeah, so I'm gonna go back and get the uh, station purchased. That was a really easy little, I guess, mini boss, honestly. Like, I was expecting when I killed the first of the two twins there for the other one to absolutely flip out at me and just start pulling out some more ridiculous attacks. Just because that's usually how that stuff goes in games, well, in like any sort of, sort of twin fight like that. Either that or for it to be, uh, kill the, kill the two of them as close to at the same time as possible. Uh, this is not the correct room. That's where, that's where Lil Willow is. Buy our new station. Bench up. Update our map. And see what we got going on. Alright, so I can go back upstairs to do a uh, place at the beginning there. If only for reasons of, like, knowing that it's a path, but... I'm pretty sure that's not where I need to go right now. I believe I'm going to have to basically complete the circle here around the rest of Fog Canyon to... Or, not Fog Canyon. Fog away, pardon me. I said Fog Canyon because the name is listed on the map. And I'm very silly sometimes. Why don't we charge up? And it's me with that shit. Oh. oh, that was a close one. I want that, I want the mushroom's lunch money. I don't know why a mushroom would have lunch money, but here we are. Oh. I fell down. Okay, so it looks like... What, do we only have the one uh, headbanger here? Okay, the, the headbanger does move forward a little bit. Like, it's kind of hard to notice, and I'm like, oh, I'm seeing things. No, no. But also, really easy pattern. Very easy to fight just one of those. Especially with nothing else around. Like, there was a single one of the tiny mushrooms. And that's it. 
So, no threat, free money. We can go up to the Forgotten Crossroads again, but I don't think that's very important here. The wah guys are more dangerous than the than the big headbanger. I enjoy that for some reason. Uh, I don't know if there's anything up there. There probably is. Can we get some more? Uh, they actually are. Yes, that would be a good idea to look those up. Oh, and get blown up by a, by a remote mine type of attack there. Uh, problem here, me not remembering how to, how to access these, because it's been a while, so I'm going to actually check my controller real quick and see what we... Oh, right, it's the... It's this thing. Gotcha! Alright, journal. Scroll down here. We gotta go down quite a bit to get to... Hello here. Oh, the fungified husk. We've seen both types of those. The shroomling. The shroomal warrior. That's the, the one that goes wah! And shroomal ogre. The shroomal ogres are... Pretty easy so far. Yeah, the, the Shrimble Warriors are a little tougher. Ack. Not today. Ooh, this is feeling a little dangerous. This setup is like really the sort of thing that kind of scares me a little bit in terms of yeah. down. Gotcha. Really noted. And that thing just popped. Okay, so the small ones are easily bursted. Uh, can I just reset those by leaving the room and exiting? Yes. A... Oh. Well, I already appreciate that that cloth wants to fight whatever it is we're gonna see down below. Because you know what? That's fair enough to me. The I do strongly enjoy characters who like to. We're down, are we? Not that much. Yikes, this, uh, is that just a loop around? That seemed a little unforgiving for that. I, like, not horribly so, but I definitely was sweating there. All that just to loop back around. Well, that definitely makes me feel like we're getting deeper into the game, and that, at least. Hi, Hornet. I saw you over there. Down. <laughs> I 
Well, this is definitely not the kind of game that I'm like good at, so I suppose I would expect not much less. Yikes. Oh, now that's just rude. Perhaps make sure that I'm at least at three. That way if I goof up in one of those fights. Gotcha, I can deal with that better next time. I probably don't really have a good sense of the timing involved there. Ooh, this fella's got a nice, fast little uh, attack pattern there. Get in, get out. going a little fast here, so we're getting, uh, getting a little better at this. Uh, uh, well, not really. I didn't. That definitely didn't look like that, did it? Gotcha. So here's uh, have a bit of a boss fight in a moment or two. down and I feel like if I'm going to take a hit from those fights I should go through instead Oh, well, that'll be why. They definitely don't like the idea of me doing that. All right, bench down to the bottom right. Which again makes me think that there's a boss fight coming up here soon. Well. Oh, I was expecting it to be like right over there. Oh, we're in, definitely in the danger zone. Oh, I fell in the acid. Ooh. There's definitely a lot going on in that room, which, uh, you can say, I guess I should see. Th yeah, I can see the map now that, now that I got a map update. Well. Alright, so. The, uh,. The shade sort of remembers where you died, I think, so it's probably going to be pretty close to the acid. Heck. I dashed too far that time. That's... Good one. Okay, right, right, right. This is not the next room. 
Yes, that I'm sure is a very obvious statement. This is not the next room. Yeah, of course. Otherwise, I'd be in the next room. Curious if I can reach him. I don't know if I can reach that fella. Oh. Pretty chunky. Oh, there's more of the little shroomlings there. Uh, do we have space for another thing? Bench only. Right. It's been a while. Ow. Cross right, because upstairs is just the forgotten crossroads, which we'll probably have to come back to at some point, but for the time being. find out at some point. And still quite nervous about that area because that really does read really like to set up to some sort of big digging boss of some kind. explodes I think both of the I think both of the the mushroom the mushroomed husks do but that one very specifically I remember We're at the bottom of the room That's the first time I've seen that, that upslash from, from that enemy. We'll just take the hits. Refill. And our shade should be in the area. Oh. That's not great. It's in this room, right? Okay, it's a little higher up. Maybe, but there's 
this to deal with first. Let's get some money. Okay, so it's back over there. I didn't see it down here. Up a little bit. Is it down? It's gonna say there's nowhere for it to go down, but there is. I just was a fool and didn't realize, oh right, that's not the bottom of the room. There's nothing over there, but there is some thing to the left here. I don't know how tall or not is there a is there a way to get up there? That looks like I'm gonna want to come around from the other side. So in fact I'm gonna go up and I'm gonna go around. I can't reach it yet, so. There's not much reason to go around. Well, This first. That's better. Hey, except for the hit that I took at the beginning. Right, whatever. What are these called? Mantis Youth and Mantis Warrior. Gotcha. Here. And this youth lost. All right, so let's go in here. just yet. Alright, so here's the Mantis Village. Is this where I want to be right now? Okay. That's, yeah. All right, come here. I remember right stick is to look around. Admittedly, sometimes it is a little easier to take those hits, but sometimes you really shouldn't do that. I'm starting to get the hang of fighting the, the youth mantises, the... They, they definitely look more like wasps in, that are also birds. That's gonna do that, okay. Then we can go across once we get up there. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's easy. I 
expected something a little more puzzling for some reason. So we want to get into that kind of supply room looking area. Supply room full of... Well, they, they kind of look like fish hooks, but I don't think that's what they're supposed to be. Alright, so... This is a trap? Taking the Mantis Claw. Letting his wall jump again. Oh, okay, we... We, uh, we Mega Man X now a little bit. Not quite, that's not, that's not what's going on, because we don't climb, we just sort of bounce around. I figured there probably would not be a double jump, at least not for a while, because of how big your one jump is to begin with. So yeah, this is more in line with, uh... Now I can reach the bug in distress. Okay. Is there anything else to do in here before I go? That feels like it should open quite a bit, but... Getting this at least. Uh, we get some more money. Try my new skill to reach that lever. Okay. Uh, what do we got here? The top of it? Uh, yes, that's where the lever is. The rock full of, uh, I'm gonna do that first. So yeah, actually, the fact that you can very easily, like, bend your wall jump to back to the same wall really does make me feel like, oh, we are kind of Mega Man X now. Oh. Again, I did that air dash a little too late. Finish that fight, get some health back. Let's hit the bench real quick. Because, you know, I will... I'll take save opportunities as regularly as necessary. I have to go around the other way. I suppose it's always a possibility. Okay, so I need to go back here and continue to go around. There's a fake wall lower down. No. Uh, let me. Let me make sure I can read the chat a little better, because admittedly my layout is not the greatest set up thing in the world. Okay, so... I'm going back in here, there's a fake wall lower down, and the fact that I'm doing occasional damage to that is not really indicative of anything, because that's just what it's like when I hit a, when I hit a wall regularly, right? What you're saying? Uh, 
and I'm just imagining things be it seems like just breaking through that upwards would be the, the easier way to handle it. Alright, what do you got for me? Dash Master. Uh, what's this do? Plus two. Dash more often as well as dash downwards. Hmm. Okay, false wall here. Dashing to dodge more. I'm. I'm definitely overestimating my movement speed a little bit. That's slightly late there. Yeah, I, I screwed that up pretty badly. I think I... <laughs> uh, should I be trying to go to the further right wall just immediately from the left side, or... Uh, I could probably just go back and equip the Dash Master and it would basically be... A little closer to free. You know, I'm gonna do that real quick. May as well use what I'm given. Well, I I'm assuming that the Dash Master saying you can dash more often means you'll get multiple air dashes. You misunderstood it's just tricky timing? Okay. Well, that's... Well, that's alright then. Uh... Take out the Soul Catcher and equip Dash Master, Thorns of Agony. I could definitely use another Charm slot, which I think... I I probably have access to one of those at this point and I've missed it. Knowing me. Oh. I predicted a I predicted a roll there. Alright. Groomlings, get out of here. Okay, so it's it's only more dashes on the ground. Gotcha. That's fine. That, however, is just me goofing up. This is going to take a moment, but again, thankfully there's, like, no danger right now. There we go. One of these, I can get rid of that real quick. Oh, that was cool. Okay. So now, over here. And now we get to a needle path here. Ooh, that's kind of scary. Oh! I switched directions too fast there. Ooh boy, this this part is going to this part is going to be some tough timing here. This is heck. I can dash right off the walls. Okay, uh, even while holding 
onto the walls. Okay. That was... I just gotta remember to actually, uh... Switch directions in midair. That helps out quite a bit. Downward dashing is not helping me right now. Uh... Yeah, I guess I should... Well... I mean... Getting out of here would be a bit of a pain. <laughs> That's all I can say about that. That's one way to get out. <laughs> Retreat! Uh... Disabled Dash Master. I don't really suppose I need that, honestly. If it's... If it's not multiple air dashes, that's not really as big of a deal as it feels like. Alright, so our, our shade is right here. Ref let's, uh, let's get our stuff back here. too early. Don't do that. That's not useful. to the needle section. And now we enter the upward needle section. This... Ow! I'm, I'm doing that a little too early here. Uh... I'm also kind of hesitating a little bit on using my dashes. I can, like, land on that little platform there as I start. Oh, and that's why I was hesitating, is because I was nervous about that happening. Well, I guess this is just generally a very nerve-wracking sort of area here. Like what they say about Mega Man level design, right? First they make you do the one thing, then they make you do it again over spikes. Wow, this... I'm, I'm doing that a lot. Yeah, this is... This part is really hard. Which, I guess, makes up for the fact that, like, most of the fighting has been pretty easy. At least I feel like it's mostly been pretty easy. Let's get our shade back. Take care of the shroomlings. Make things a little harder on ourselves, apparently, by uh, getting two of these fellas in here. Recharge. Can we recharge from the, the shroomlings? I don't think we quite have enough for three heals, which is unfortunate because I really did goof that up a little bit in that fight. Although we'll we'll fix things with that. Alright. Needles one. Needles two. Oh, I was doing good for a second there. 
Heck. Oh, it's getting tighter. It's getting tighter. Refill. Refill. I'm starting to get the hang of this part here. Oh. Okay. Fly down the wall. All right. So... I was going to say, I had a bad feeling about that because I saw the orange smoke coming out of... Coming out of Rafaela's head here. This might be a bit of a trap. Or not. Can you get back to town easily? There we go. That was a pretty tough room, I'm not gonna lie. But... It was a good challenge, not like the acid thing. Oh... Fuck me. That moment when you just goof up a really easy jump after doing something hard. That's pretty humbling. Okay, so... Map, please? Uh, Mantis Village. It looks like there's nothing else to do there, but there's a, a hole in the bottom and the top. Uh... Now I suppose we go back upstairs? I don't need you to look up yet, uh... Chief. Yikes. I think I just missed where the whatever I was supposed to aim for was there. You know, this part of the room is a little clearer. I could probably just stand a wall jump more. Now that the uh, the Mantis Youth is gone. It's still a name that slightly confuses me because that doesn't feel very Mantis-y. But, uh... Heal and accidentally hit our head on a really easy platform there. You need your space to do your attacks, I get it. Go back up. That's fine. Sometimes just... Okay, let me see if I can... ash out in my brain. Uh, I'm going back to... the map room, I believe. Yes, I'm like obsessively checking the map because, yeah. Oh, you think so? We'll, we'll see how this goes. Ow! That was not too great. We need a recharge here. Okay, so if we go left from here. Yeah, I know what it's like to have a cold. Of 
Very close by to follow where Hornet went. Well, I know where that is, I th think. Let's deal with these, because they're the, the little mushroom caps whose names I didn't look up are pretty easy. Here? Yeah, I think this is the direction. That, that bridge is not there. Okay. Ooh, that seems a little tight. Assuming this, this is what I have to do. Emblems, okay. That, again, was me hitting the wrong button. Ooh. Well, well, good thing we respawned right here. Oh. All right, we landed the lever. That is good. Can you give us that? I do have to jump over this tiny little bit of thorn here. Simple. City Crest. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. It opens... That was quite a slam. Ow! That was... Not exactly expected behavior. But thankfully we respawn right here. Is there shade gonna be right there? Yes. Well, that's helpful. Gotcha, so they're they're like screes after ingesting ten gallons of nitroglycerin. Oh hey, those fellas from very early on. They were like one of the first enemies I encountered. And I don't remember their names now. I'll look that up, I guess. Uh yeah, those just Uh I passed by it. Leaping husk, okay. Right, right, a lot of those are just Variant us and ah! I hear, I hear that fella. Where's uh, right down there. Okay, I'll just bring that back up, right? Just gotta make sure. Okay, so does it go back up from... Okay, yes. Very simple, but I just had to make sure that there wasn't something else going on here. Alright, let's bench up. Get our map updated. And we don't have a map in this area, but it should give us map updates for the previous zones. I'm going to take a little look forward and see what's going on in the rest of the area. Yeah, maybe we can purchase a 
purchase a map. Oh, did I miss, uh, did I miss a chance to talk to... I didn't see that I could talk to the person on the bench. There we go. Alright, Quirrell, what do you have for us? Uh, it's probably something else. Oh, that was some uh, some choppiness, but it seemed to be audio only, so I'm not too concerned. down and to the left. So over here. Over here? Ah! Don't land in the water. Oh, well. Well, that was, uh... I like how... I like how our husk sentry there just, uh... Oh, is the... It's safe for us to... On the surface of that water. Safe probably being a very strong word for it. I assume if we spent too much time there, it wouldn't be great. It's just water, it's fine. Okay. Alright. What have you got for mm, us? Ah, Ranjo Stenja. Ale Smith. Oh, absolutely. I will pay for a. I'll pay for a sort of level two sword here. Juncha. Oh, that looked cool. Garadel Akari. Not sure why I was expecting it to look different, but here we are. All right, so we're definitely we're, we're definitely doing more damage. If I want to see if it's like double, I'd want to get into a fight with something a little chunkier. Unfortunately, I forgot how, how many t uh, hits the, the husk knight took to take down before. It does on the inventory screen. Okay. That makes things easier. More mask shards to. Check it through the rest of the stuff now. Oh, okay. 
remember to use the elevator correctly. Oh, that was silly. I can wall climb though, so it's not as big of an issue. The music here is really nice. Well, I think it's also maybe a little more substantial than in previous areas, perhaps. Across here. Geo. Oh, okay, so I gotta go around. Let's get ourselves a cutscene, I guess. Hakana Sagamos Well, no fight, that's fine. I was not ready for one, so. Okay, so I'm going to head back to the bench, and I think I'm going to call it here for the evening. This is definitely, uh, I'm very interested in where this is going, so this is something that I will be putting properly into the rotation. Expect this to come back sometime next week, once I hash out for sure how I'm going to schedule out my streams. Although perhaps I shouldn't be out here like, oh yeah, I don't do do the outro thing while I'm still recording, but eh. get there. Side and this nice bench here. And yeah, 